Welcome back. Our next guest here, Drew Davenport, is a, is a board-certified local music therapist and is here to teach us how he's helping Hoosiers of all ages and abilities through the power of music. Hey, Drew. How you doing? Hi, Drew. Hey, good morning. We're Thanks happy to have you here, man. This is a really unique field. Not a lot of people know, maybe they've heard of music therapy, yeah. but they don't really know what it's all about. So kind of give us the overview. What is music therapy? Yeah, so I get that a lot. A lot of people say, you know, I hear you're a music therapist. I've heard about that. But what is that? So. Music has a really unique ability to, uh, it's very powerful in its ability to affect us in some pretty profound ways. And yeah. I'm sure you're a musician, you know, I'm sure. sure you guys can have your own examples of that. So um, with music therapy, it's a clinical evidence-based use of music by a trained professional to help utilize the brain in the way that music affects the brain mm. to access and to um, address individual goals that you might have. Okay. So my job, to, you know, to say that simply is kind of uh, my job is to look at the power of music and research has shown that the brain is very, very active when we listen to music or partake in music and a lot of times and when we don't even realize, you know, how much it's affecting us. So my job is kind of to use music and the way that it affects the brain to help people reach their goals yeah. and to make their lives better in any way that they seem fit. Yeah. Yeah, music is so healing. Mm -hmm. Can you talk about maybe some of the people you help because I'm sure there's such a wide range of examples. Yeah, so you hear the word universal used a lot with music, you know, is so universal in that people, you know, from birth till, you know, till we leave, uh, music is a very important part of our lives. Yeah. I mean, imagine your favorite m movie without music, you know, it would be significantly different. Mm -hmm. So really there are all kinds of different populations that you can work with music therapy. And in the state of Indiana, there's a lot of work done in the Medicaid waiver, and I work some in the Medicaid waiver, um, but all the way up through geriatrics and, mm -hmm. and all kinds of different abilities and that kind of thing so um, right now with my company what I do is I have looked for places that uh, are could really benefit from music therapy yeah. but are maybe have performers but don't have specifically music therapy there yeah. and so my I've really looked for places that could really benefit from music and I'm trying to share that to places that wouldn't otherwise receive it that's great I would love to hear an example yeah. of how you walk through now I know every session is probably much more in depth than we have time for now but kind of walk us through how you help people Drew yeah let me just give you a couple examples of some songs that and you might recognize now as I play a couple of just really short clips of these I want you to just be aware of what's happening with you and what you what kind of things come up in your in your mind and okay. yeah. and what happens to your body as you listen so with this one I see trees of green red roses too I see them bloom for me and you yes and I think to myself what a wonderful how about this one a different way to hear? I'm dreaming oh, of nice. a white Christmas. Or one of my favorites that we use a lot is You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. You make me happy when skies are gray. You'll never know, dear, how much I love you. Sunshine away. I feel like we probably should for Aaron. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to you. Happy 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 birthday to you. Aaron, don't hide. We got a smile out of it. Hey, That's really cool. You know, I noticed as you were playing each one different memories came back, yeah. different responses, some verbal, some physical responses. Uh -huh. That was really, really cool. And I appreciate you sharing that with us. If people want to get in touch with you and maybe learn more about how you can help them or one of their loved ones, or just learn more about music therapy in general, how can they follow you? Yeah, well, they can find me on, I have, my business is just Drew Davenport Music Therapy. You can find me at DrewDavenportMusicTherapy.com. And uh, with that, what I do is I'm looking for just anywhere in the area who feels like their facility could benefit from music therapy. Yeah. Um, a lot of places I work are assisted living facilities with mm -hmm. the aging population and that kind sure. of thing. But so like we were mentioning as you're thinking as all those feelings are coming up and you're remembering, remembering things and tapping your foot and that, you know, it's because your brain is working. That doesn't happen yeah. by yeah. accident. So the ability to access the brain in that unique way really helps us to be able to do that. So um, again, under the Medicaid waiver, if someone is on the waiver, there are a lot of music therapists and a yeah. lot of great companies in the area that work under the Medicaid waiver. So um, you can do that. You can also go to um, musictherapy.org 
Org is the official American Music Therapy website. Okay. We have rosters of music therapies on there. That's great. So. Drew, thank you so much, thank man. You Best for wishes your to you as well. Us. That was fun. Yes, thank Pleasure. you so much. Yeah, thanks, Drew. Coming up next, we're going to tell you how you can take in the solar eclipse on April 8th down in Bloomington. The